Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this triangle ABC such that uh, these line segments uh, BD, ED, EC and AC are equal in length and moreover ABC is an isosceles triangle because AB equal to BC. And now we are going to calculate this angle uh, x please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe so before we proceed any further let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100 percent true to the scale let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's our very first step let's focus on this triangle ebd we know that this is an isosceles triangle since this side length equal to this one so therefore if this angle is x this angle has got to be x as well so therefore our this angle bed turns out to be x degrees and here's our next step let's recall exterior angle theorem an exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of two opposite interior angles as you can see in this uh, diagram we can see that this uh, angle A and B are our opposite interior angles and this angle C is going to be our exterior angle in other words C equals to A plus B so therefore in our case these angles are our opposite uh, interior angles and it's uh, this angle is going to be our exterior angle and that is going to be equal to X plus X is going to make uh, 2 X therefore our this angle EDC is going to be 2x and here's our next step let's focus on this triangle EDC we know that this is an isosceles triangle since this side length equal to this one if this angle is 2x this angle has got to be 2x as well so therefore our angle ECD turns out to be 2x and here's our next step let's focus on this uh, triangle BCE and let's recall this exterior angle theorem once again according to this theorem this angle is going to be our exterior angle and this is going to be the sum of these two opposite uh, interior angles 2x plus x that is going to become 3x so therefore our angle AEC turns out to be 3x and now let's focus on this triangle AEC we know that this is an isosceles triangle since this side length equal to this one that means if this angle is 3x this angle has got to be 3x as well so therefore our angle EAC turns out to be 3x and now let's focus on this big triangle ABC we know that this is an isosceles triangle since this side length AB equal to this side length BC therefore if this angle is 3x this angle has got to be 3x as well therefore our this angle ACB turns out to be 3x and now we can see in this triangle ABC the sum of all these three angles must be equal to 180 degrees therefore let me go ahead and add them up so x plus 3x plus 3x has got to be equal to 180 degrees on the left hand side if we add them that's going to give us 7x equal to 180 degrees let's divide both side by 7 so therefore our angle x is going to be equal to 180 divided by 7 degrees so thus our angle x turns out to be 180 divided by 7 degrees or in terms of decimals x is approximately equal to 25.7 degrees thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye